bored. I require entertainment. No, you don't. No. Please, I'm so bored. I yearn for knowledge. Okay, personally, I don't give a d <sighs> Fine. What is it that you wish to know? I mean, I kind of think we should have more liquidity in the market. Like, there should be more money in the hands of the people. Okay, I'm vetoing that idea. You know what you're gonna learn about? You're gonna learn about trade. That's what you're gonna learn about. Okay, but trade means nothing to me. Trade is what you do when you don't want something and you want someone else's thing, so. Actually, trade's a lot more in depth than you think. It goes way back, yes, to that sort of concept, but there's more to it than you think. Hey, I really like your earring. Oh, thanks. Uh, I really, really like your necklace. Uh, really? Oh, that's so sweet. Um, I'll be honest, I don't really like my necklace. Oh, what? I mean, but it's so pretty. Oh, well, yeah, but I'm just not a huge fan of it, you know? Well, um, I'm not really a huge fan of my earring, you know? <laughs> what? But it's such a nice color. Yeah, but, you know, <laughs> I think we should trade. This was an example of a trade. There are many different ways to conduct trades, however. I'll give you a goat for your daughter's hand in marriage. Mm. I want two goats. I have a child. Oh. Yeah, that works. There you go. Can I have my goat and child now? Yeah. Hey, get over here. Why do I have to go to the mines? <sighs> well, maybe don't trade your daughter off for some sheep and a child, but this is a prime example of what we call a barter trade. In this situation, we have two items that store value, and they're both being exchanged at an equal value to each person. Here, this man's daughter uh, is worth a sheep and a child. I hope you're making some kind of sense to you, because... I can't think of any more examples. I mean, yeah, but why did you have to use me in one of your examples? I don't want to work in a mine. Well, frankly, I should put you in a mine. Can you give me an example for like, I don't know, sweaty gamers? That's oddly specific, but I could probably make do, yeah. Come on, let's get in your game. Uh, so, you ever gone to a store in your game? Let's say here in the Coral Canyons one. You see all this here? This is a trade. However, it's a trade for money for items. So let's see what we want. I'm kind of liking this hat, personally. I think it looks kind of stupid. Well, I don't really care what you think. I'm buying it anyway. Suit yourself. Anyway, what I just did was exchanged money for an item. Mm, I guess you're right, this hat's kind of stupid. Yeah, I told you so. Do you need another example? I, th I think it'd be really helpful. Can you show me a trade again? All right, well, let's run on out and see what other players have right now. So we have a bunch of people saying, trade me, trade me. And they're doing this because they're interested in getting this item, for example, for another one. I'll be honest, that item is worth a lot more than anything I have in my inventory. So any trade I made, even if it is, let's say a rare trade, is simply not worth it for them. Let's see what other items I might have. But why wouldn't they want my trade? Well, if things aren't worth the same thing, they won't want them. See, for example, we have that item right there. Whoa, what's that? Huh. Okay. Okay, let's see if anyone here will accept any of our trades. Hmm, not really interested in that item personally. Let's see. Nah. Uh, not too interested in what they have. Oh, let's see what they have. Hey, I really like that sword. Can you get it? Yeah, let's try it. Mm. Let's see. Oh, why did they do that? Well, they probably determined that the item that we gave them wasn't worth the same amount as their item. But you wanted it, right? Well, yeah, but... 
they didn't want what I wanted, so it's an unfair trade and they declined it, meaning we didn't get what we wanted in the end. I'm sorry your trades didn't work. I hope you were still able to learn. Yeah, it was helpful seeing a diagram, I guess. Well, in case you're wondering, they didn't accept our trades because they realized that what we were giving them was just not worth what their items were. So, it has to be of equal value, right? Absolutely. If it's not of equal value, then people wouldn't accept it. It's like that sheep marriage goat story. Oh. Well, I wonder if I'm worth a goat and a child. Eh, they're not worth that much. Hey! You're very cruel to me.